Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and today we're gonna do a video on this beauty, Juki LK-1910. As you know, this uh, looks like a regular bar tech machine, the LK-1900, but um, there are so many different things that you could do now with bar tech machine. And there is so many different um, uh, stitching and um, uh, different stuff that you wanna do that there is a LK-1900, there's a LK-1910, 1920, and so forth and so on. So this is pretty much a 1910 with a bigger platform, or a 1900, bigger, bigger platform. So what happened is there are a lot of stitching that um, you want to do, and you can't just do it with your hand moving around. So instead of you moving around and doing it, and doing it wrong, you will have a machine like 1910 because a larger platform that will do the stuff for you. Now, this machine is computerized. You could do many, 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 many different type of uh, programming here. It's programmable. I'm not gonna touch the programming. I don't know how to program this, but um, there are many people that know how to program it. There are, I mean, you can if you could go online and learn. It's square, box, round, only one long line, left, cross, whatever you want to do. Denim jeans, if you want to patch it, a lot of stuff, if you have a patch, you just want to go around it. Imagine, let's go in here. Let's go, you have a patch. Now, this is, what comes with the machine is uh, five and a half by, I think, I'm going to check, why do I think, three. You could order larger platform and pay for it. This one, I mean, the clamp but it cannot be bigger than this. I mean, these same customers that ordered this machine from us, they're ordering two more clamps from us. And those are bigger, different style. And uh, we're gonna deliver to them. This machine is going out to them today. It took us maybe about a month, maybe less than a month from the time they ordered. I just wanna tell you, where they're more uh, specialty machine, we have to order them through Juki, and Juki sent them to us, and then we have to order the table, the leg, we have to put them together. And this machine happened to be electrical, 110 volt or 220 volt. You could have both. There is a small change of wiring that we'll do it here. If you have a facility that has 220 volt, you could do it. If you don't have a facility, like the person that we're sending it to, they want 110. We change it to 110 and it's going on a regular plug in the back and it needs air. It needs air for raising the clamp and a regular air with a regular small tiny tank would be good. Special table that we have made here in USA, again 48 by 24 um, on a regular K leg, uh, but it comes, the machine comes with own pedal, as you could see here, there is the own pedal. Um, beauty, this machine could do anything up to uh, 138 thread, nylon thread. Um, it comes with oil. Let's see the stuff that comes with. Bunch of screwdrivers. Um, owner's manual, dust cover. Um, needle. The needle is 135 by 17. Bobbins. Regular bobbins. Um, not a regular sewing machine. It, it, if I, uh, I'm gonna try to remember it and tell you guys what is gonna be the bobbin. Um, bobbin is here, right here. And the bobbin case is right here. You pull it out, like any normal sewing machine, you thread it. There is an automatic bobbin winder on the machine, hopefully somewhere. And where is it? Let's find it. Well, here. I'm sorry, the bobbin winder right here, automatic, you put the bobbin on, you do, do it, thread. We're doing today T105 thread, and not a uh, regular polyester thread. Um, and here we go. I'm gonna turn off the machine, I'm gonna turn on the machine, and right here. By the way, this is the direct drive, there is no motor, it's com fully computerized. You see that? The whole computer is down there and come with a special pedal. I turn on the machine. You get this, 
you could select language every time. We want USA, we just go ahead and set press. I press, all right. And then here, this is a clamp. And what we have here already programmed from the company is around. Um, I, I think it's, uh, I think it's a two inch diameter, what it is. I'm gonna measure it for you. It is one inch diameter. All right, so I got a regular cotton fabric and I'm gonna put it down here. And again, this is what you wanna work with. This wool, you could do so many different things and you could put it on different uh, memories, um, different style, again, Xbox, if you wanna do within this frame right here. Maybe even one eighth less than the frame, okay? So I have this here, I put my foot on the press, I think I have to. Okay, so I had to turn this to let her know that I'm ready to go. Hands off. You press the right side and the clamp goes down and then you just touch, press the left, or maybe you don't. and you are done. Beauty, you could adjust tension. Again, you could do, let me do four layers. I just wanna know what is the needle size. So a lot of people ask if we could um, have smaller, um, that the 1900 could do only one inch by one inch, you know, when you have the new clamp. This is the next one up that could do a, a big, big uh, frame. Uh, down, Ooh, the thread came out. Why? I don't know. I'm gonna check with my glasses, where's my glasses here? All right. guys work at home or in your place of work, please um, use turn off the machine when you're doing this. And thank you for the tweezer. You always want this to be handy. We're trying, it's trying to ship this out them out. And I'm just doing a quick, quick, quick video. So threading, you'll see the thread, you have thread stand, everything that comes with it, the way the thread goes. You're gonna get a LED lamp from us. And it's going, baby. Let's go. This come very hand. I love tweezers. Mm. Already. I'm gonna go back to a normal, I mean, you could do more heavy stuff, but I'm gonna go back to the two layers just to make sure that wasn't the reason the thread came out. Or maybe there is no thread on the bottom, but it's okay. I don't see any error code here, so I'm assuming everything is okay. Down. And voila. Okay, it didn't cut. It should cut. All right, I'm gonna, again, you get the idea of what I mean when I say that this has to be, um, I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna let it go. Down and let's see. some reason I'm thinking maybe this is too heavy. Maybe the needle has to be changed for a heavier material. Um, I don't think so. It's just adjustment. Um, it's um, 
you know, most of the problem when the thread is breaking, and I always say it, and I keep saying it is uh, tension and threading the sewing machine. So I was at the place we were setting up a sewing machine yesterday on a brand new uh, 2860 monster walking full double needle sewing machine. And we had problem of breaking the thread. It took me like half an hour just to get it to work. But you gotta be patient. It's just tension when you change the top and bottom thread. Uh, these machines are computerized, very delicate. So I'm gonna go ahead, make sure. I'm gonna, let, let me just show them how to take the bobbins out. Meanwhile, I wanna make sure it is here. You see that? Take the thread out and I'm gonna take the thread out. All right, I'm gonna put it back in there. Obviously go from this slide through, come down here and stay right here, right? So I'm guessing that some of these, some people do it, some people don't. I put it through the thread right here, let it go. Hold this and put it in. And close the latch. Make sure it's in place. Close this. All right. One more time, senorita. And down. I'm guessing we need to work on the tension uh, to not to get these things. I'm gonna do one more time. Again, it is very important when you start the sewing machine, make sure the tension is on the K. Uh, the threading is right. When you pull, I need to pull, make sure that I have enough tension. It's a great machine. I'm just showing you how it's gonna work. Again, this is going to be your, maybe I play with this. Uh, no, should I? I don't know. I don't know what, you know, again, anyways. Uh, this one will tell you how much thread you have on the bobbin. Uh, you could adjust the pressure of the um, the height of the clamp, the needle positioning, all of that stuff could be set up from here. There is a book, there is YouTube videos, and there is me sometimes when it comes to a lot of stuff I could call uh, Juki and I find out. But here is the machine. And it's a big platform for making, again, X box set. You want to do cross, you want to do uh, frame, you want to do patches. This is your machine. It's a great, great sewing machine made by Juki LK1910. And uh, I might add, it's made in Japan. Oil goes in here uh, and in here. And you'll see how much oil you have. That's all you need. This new generation called um, dry head. The great sewing machine. Thank you for watching this day from Gold Star Tool. If you have any question, let me know. You could find the machine on our website. Let me know what type of sewing machine you want me to do for you. Um, showcase, and here we go. Thank you for watching.